You know, when it comes to employment history, what's important? History is the key. Means going backwards, right? Well, we expect a two-year employment history in most cases to get a loan. There's a few exceptions. When you go to school, you get a college degree or maybe a certificate class of some kind that shows you took this serious and we use that in lieu of the two years experience. Otherwise, we need a two year history of you working. It doesn't have to be on the same job, but it must be two years of work. So if you're looking at a commission job, we're gonna need, you know, close to a two year history of you working commission so we could average out the income. You can't say, hey, I've been working at this job for three months, I'm making great money, I'm making 10 grand a month now. It, it, it really doesn't work that way. You need a history going backwards. If you're hourly or salary, that's fine. But if we need overtime, you have to have a history of working overtime. It can't be, hey, I, I, I worked 18 hours overtime last week, can I use it? No, unfortunately not. This is really important because people ask me all the time, hey Chris, what if I go get a second job? That would be awesome for you. You'll bring extra money in the house, but I can't use that income for two years. So why two years? Because people get jobs just so they have some extra money and that doesn't mean they're gonna stick it out. They work over time, but it doesn't mean they're gonna stick it out and continue to work over time. So a history is the key and all documentation, everything we have to prove pretty much goes by a two year history.